As Kate Middleton visited Meghan Markle since the Duchess of Sussex has been on maternity leave, since she began her maternity leave in March 2019 Meghan Markle has been tucked away in her new home Frogmore Cottage as she awaits the arrival of baby Sussex. Though Prince Harry has been by her side Markle's mother, Doria Ragland has only just arrived in the United Kingdom meaning Markle has spent a fair amount of time alone. Since most of Markle's closest friends are in the United States and Canada, and she now lives about an hour away from her old home Kensington Palace where Prince William, Kate Middleton, and their kiddos live we wondered if Markle might get lonely. Luckily the Duchess has had a couple of visitors since moving to Frogmore. As Kate Middleton visited Meghan Markle at Frogmore Cottage, when Meghan Markle and Prince Harry were engaged in living in their two-bedroom apartment at Kensington Palace Markle would often visit Kate Middleton who was pregnant with Prince Louis and battling severe morning sickness Hyperemesis Gravidarum. Now, it looks like Middleton has returned the favor by visiting with Markle. Though Markle did not attend church service or Queen Elizabeth's birthday celebration on Easter Sunday she did get some lovely visitors later in the day. Both Prince William and Kate Middleton visited Markle to see how she was doing in the final days of her pregnancy. They also got to check out the newly renovated Frogmore Cottage. Since the Cambridge's royal duties have not slowed down and Markle shows no signs of going into labor they wanted to take her a housewarming gift and spend some quiet, child-free time with her as she rested. Are Meghan Markle and Kate Middleton friends? Meghan Markle and Kate Middleton don't have very much in common but they are very friendly. Princess Diana's former butler Paul Burrell told Us Weekly, they are different women with different roles from different cultures. Kate knows that Meghan is no threat to her, and Meghan is mature enough to realize that her role is vastly different to Kate's. On Commonwealth Day in mid-March 2018, Markle's last public appearance before her maternity leave they publicly put rumors of their feud to rest with some sisterly PDA. Middleton greeted her very pregnant sister-in-law with a warm kiss on the cheek. However, a royal insider told Vanity Fair that it was all very deliberate. They explained, they might not have a huge amount in common, but Kate has no issue with Meghan. She wants them to get along not just for Harry's sake but because two royal sisters-in-law at loggerheads wouldn't be good, and Kate knows that. For Kate, it's about keeping their relationship professional and putting on a show of togetherness. There are no bad feelings, and I think Kate was keen to put an end to these rift rumors. She has no problem with Meghan, and she has made it clear to Meghan that she's there for advice or whatever Meghan might need.